Wendy here from Draw So Cute. In this video, I'm going to show you how to draw my Draw So Cute turkey. So let's get started. With this turkey, we're going to first start by drawing his head. So right here, we're going to draw a big curve that goes all the way across. So right here, we draw a big curve for the top of his head. And so notice how it's narrow up here and flares out. And so right here, I'm just going to continue down and come around. Same thing with the other side. And come around and connect it. So this is basically um, all my draw so cute animals have this kind of head, kind of like a big, call it like a big dumpling, <laughs> little ball right there. And so now I'm going to give him his little body. So right here I'm just going to draw a curve, same thing on the other side, and connect it with a curve. Like that. And so you see big head and a little body makes it really cute. So I'm going to go in and give him these huge eyes just to make him even cuter. And another one right here. And so draw so cute eyes have two small circles inside, curved line at the bottom, and shade in the top. So here the circle's not that great, but you can always fix it. So it's just shade in the top. Give him extra big eyes to make him extra cute. And the lines at the bottom. And so same thing other side, two small circles, and a curved line at the bottom, and shade in the top. I hope everyone is having, um, has a lot of big plans for Thanksgiving. Have a nice big dinner with your family. I love this time of the year with this weather getting cooler and all these uh, festivities and Christmas coming up. I have so many drawings planned for you guys. <laughs> so there, big ol' eyes. And so right here I'm just going to give him a little curve on the top. here. And of course his little beak. So right find the center right here, I'm going to draw a curve. And we're going to connect it with kind of a good wide V. So come back to the center and go back up. And so now we're going to draw that, I'm going to call it that red thing. Because <laughs> I don't know what it's called right now. I have to Google it. I forgot what it was called. But right here, start over here. And we're going to curve up a little bit. Come around, down, go back, and come back up to the beak. And so it's just, just imagine kind of like you're drawing a big teardrop that just kind of hangs over this beak right here. And so now that we have his little cute little face in, we can draw his body. So right here, I'm just going to follow this curve and I'm going to draw his wing. So come down, follow the same curve and bring it back up a little bit like that. So same thing other side, follow the curve and come up. And for his little feet, find the center right here. And we're just going to flare out two uh, feet right here. So just draw. One, two, three. I'm just going to give him three. One, two, and three. Like that. Very simple. And so from some details right here on his body, you can just draw some feathers. So I'm just going to give like maybe four. One, two, three, four. And bring it around. And then another layer. One, two, three. And so now for his beautiful tail. So the trick to drawing um, the tail to make it look um, a little bit more even all the way around is to start with the two bottom ones first. So I'm going to start right here. I'm going to draw one because it comes around. And so imagine it kind of all flares around his head. So it, all the lines are going to be kind of like a at a um, angle that flares out. So right here, find where we start this line about right there. 
and come across about right there and we're going to draw another curve and try and match it the same so you can use these kind of like guidelines to measure and just curve it around and right here then now go to the center right here and draw another curve for the feather so i'm just going to draw another one for the center right there so now um, you basically are guaranteed that you have this this even so now this will be pretty much nice and even so you figure you can put about one two three more so let's go in and put three more one kind of like drawing a flower almost let's go very simple doesn't have to be perfect like that so it's the same thing so about one two three same thing and you can give yourself guidelines by just going across putting points so you kind of know where the other one ended and also imagine it's all in a circle so you want to back there that point you made and another one it goes back in so now you can go in and add some details so just like to put in some curved lines here for the tip of his tail wing that way you can give it more color <laughs> it won't just be all brown and boring so just go all the around and one more and I forgot <laughs> let's draw this little feather that sticks out of the head just to make him extra cute so up here in the center I'm just gonna draw a curve comes down and another one comes out and back in like that so there my cute little turkey for thanksgiving i hope you guys are all have um all big plans for thanksgiving and celebrate with your family thanks so much for watching please give me a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to get updates of more draw so cute videos see you later